What's going on guys, it's Colin here for Next Gen Tactics, and I'm playing some Battlefield 3 beta on the PC. And right out of the gates, I kind of got stuck in a glitchy spot on the map, and uh, was having trouble getting out of there, and when I tried to run to the objective, I don't know if it was a destruction glitch or what, but, like, I was just uh, ha having a ton of trouble, so I wind up looking like I'm not really playing the objective here, because I'm just trying to navigate the map, but anyway. Um, impressions of the beta, so far... It's, uh, it's absolutely beautiful. It's a beautiful game, for sure. And it looks even better than the alpha. They've upped the graphics. And I'm running at... When I'm recording, I'm getting about 60, 65 frames per second. So if you want to, my channel link will be in the description. You can go check out my PC specs on my channel. Uh, they're in the About Me section. But uh, you can know that with that setup, which is just a little bit better than recommended settings. Um, on And actually, I'm just running on auto graphics right now. I haven't tried to tweak anything yet and uh, haven't really customized anything. I just hopped into the game. But anyway, with those settings, I am running over 60 frames per second. So I'd like to be maybe a little bit higher. I might look at overclocking my graphics card, but I'm pleased with that for now. So uh, there might be more optimization done for the release. Don't know. Now, how's the game playing? It's uh, it's really smooth. Now, I've had uh, a, a few issues with, uh, with some lag, and actually, a lot of the servers have been having troubles, so it takes a long time to try and get into a game. I'm just kind of taking what I can get for a server connection, so right now, I think I'm uh, playing out of uh, Germany or something. So, I'm getting a few lag issues, and occasionally, you know, um, some glitchy animations and that sort of thing, which is quite possibly related to that lag, but uh, other than that, the, the way that, uh, you know, it's PC, so the controls are as uh, sensitive and precise as you want them to be, the guns are not easy to handle, there's a ton of recoil, I'm uh, more on that, I guess, as I explore and play with different weapons, I'm just running the default uh, unlock for the, the first weapon for the engineer kit, uh, sorry, the assault kit. I switched after the uh, first base, so I'm running the AK-74M, which is a pretty effective rifle. I had a good time with it in the alpha. Now, uh, around the animations, so a lot of people had concerns around like drop shotting and that sort of thing. Like your gun movement, it, it, it's matched up really well with the animations. So I mean, when you drop to prone, as you can see, like my gun is, uh, it. I don't just drop with my aim right down my sights, right? The gun it flops around a little bit. When you get back up, the gun flops around a little bit. You're not able to fire while you're dropping into prone. So here I'm going to pick up a double spray, but unfortunately I get taken down. So these guys actually pushed into uh, into our base pretty good and eventually they get behind us into our spawn area so I get shot in the back a couple of times this was my first gameplay that I managed to record and not get booted I think it might be my second round so I uh, wanted to kind of bring you my first play but uh, this is my first recordable play <laughs> and it's uh, obviously not going to be the best gameplay I'm still trying to get used to the sensitivity the controls and the weapon handling and all of that um, but re really I mean looks gorgeous smooth uh, I really like you know I tried to liken it to anticipate what it was gonna play like whether it was gonna be like a bad company 2 or a Medal of Honor and it uh, I've played enough Battlefield 2 to to think that you know the way that your your character moves around it feels a little bit more like that than it does bad company 2 or Medal of Honor and uh, you know a lot more recoil um, I wouldn't really liken it to Medal of Honor at all, other than the fact that uh, that game was also quite beautiful. So, uh, they get the station iron. We're going to try and clean them up. And right here, this is one complaint that I've had, and this has been something since the alpha, that uh, occasionally, you know, I'll just drop dead. I, you see, I got three hit notifiers there all at the same time. I just died. And he was in pretty close quarters, so I probably didn't have a chance. But the frustrating thing there is that... Um, you know, you don't get the feedback that you're getting hit. And that's something that might very well be related to connection, because mine sucks. And I know that I complained most about this, although I saw some uh, that some other people had the same issues. And right there, he just pops out of nowhere and takes me down. But our team actually gets the disarm, and even though they flanked in the spawn and are going to shoot me in the back again as soon as I spawn in, uh, we do take the win. So, anyway, that's my first game. I'll try and get some attacking gameplay for you. And uh, really, guys, I'm impressed so far. It is a beta. There are some day one issues with the servers, and I know that a lot of people are having some issues getting the keys out the door, but uh, the beta keys. But overall, it's been um, playing really great. Can't wait to show you more. Cheers, guys. We'll talk soon. Did you like this video? If you did, check out a couple of these. On NGT Games, we have Spider that started Resistance 3. Solo is now joined by Meat Wagon in a Resistance 3 co-op campaign. Be sure to check it out on NGT Games. Next off, on the right side, we have NGT Minecraft. 
and we are talking about what is to come of our server and what we plan on doing with that. Guys, please be sure to subscribe to NGT Games and NGT Minecraft and click the videos to check them out.